two boys were home alone in their apartment while the parents went down to visit their neighbors. Their parents said to the, their sons, be good boys and no video gaming. To keep themselves occupied, the brothers decided to play a game of hide and seek. So the older brother said, I'll do the counting, you go hide. He covered his eyes and counted down from 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ready or not, here I come, he said. And he turned around to go find his brother. You know what, boys and girls? He looked everywhere in the apartment. He couldn't find his brother anywhere. He looked under the kitchen cabinets. He looked in the hallway closet. He looked in the bedroom closet. He looked in their laundry room. He looked under the bed, behind the sofa, inside the TV cabinet. No sign of his younger brother. The apartment grew eerily quiet. He started to get worried. Where are you? I, I can't find you, he said. That's when he heard a scraping sound coming from the bedroom closet. He thought to himself, I already checked the bedroom closet. I'm sure of it. My brother's not in there. But he went in again to check for his brother. No sign of him. The sound grew louder and louder. So he moved all of the clothes. He even looked underneath the shoe shelf. He bent down, but he couldn't see any tiny feet peering under the shelves. As he tried to get up from out of the closet, a tiny white icy hand tried to pull him down. It grabbed his wrist. It tried to pull him into the closet. As he was trying to pull himself free, he heard a voice behind him. It was his little brother. His brother was looking at him with his hands on his hips saying, you couldn't find me. The older brother desperately tried to pull himself free with his younger brother trying to pull him free as well. But the white hand was very strong and extremely cold. Finally, they were able to pull free. They both ran screaming from the apartment. Nobody knows what would have happened if the hand had managed to pull the older brother in. Do you?